Hey, you look just like Ariel. No, Ariel. I don't. With that braid in there. Funny baby. shit. You a mermaid, baby. <laughs> You hit that, you just hit that though. <laughs> I hope y'all can hear Marcel outside. I don't think y'all can. And Blue. Lord, babe, you struggling. What the? Not too happy to see me, baby. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, I cooked lunch for us. Wife Life episode 5000 on my channel. If you want to see how my day goes and what I do from day to day as a stay at home wife for now, because I'm getting back to work more than likely in the fall. But I don't care. I mean, I'm excited. You know, I'm so excited. And so. Babe, I babe, I had to do some. So, Blue barked at his food coming, uh, being dropped off, yeah. and I was like Blue. Uh -huh. And so I think he thought that I was like telling him he was bad. So I felt bad because he came and you know how when he barked, we be like okay Blue, or we be like Blue, and then he come and sit right here. Yeah. So I felt like he was like sad or mad that I had um told him to hush mm -hmm. but i didn't know i thought he was barking at you i'm like why is he barking at you like that so because i felt bad because he felt bad i dug into my salmon i gave him a middle piece that had, didn't have any seasoning on you it gave him salmon? i gave him salmon Oh, baby, tree. and when i gave him salmon he didn't leave me he like stood there like tunnel vision he was like i ain't never <laughs> taste something this good <laughs> <laughs> Baby, sad. Baby blue sword. Oh, oh, let me show you how cute I was before I put my hair in a ponytail. Ooh. I got like the two braids and then I have it like this. You're not love, you put the little braids in. And then I have it like this. You look good, baby. Wait. Oh, I like your uh, necklace too. Yeah, and then I have a ring on, but I took it off because I'm trying to eat. Yeah. Um, um, I picked up the camera because I have two date ideas. Okay. Do you want to just? Do you want me to just give you the date ideas, or do you want it to be like a pull out the hat type vibes? Give it to me. Why? If you want me to do the hat. No, I don't want you to do nothing. I want you to do what you want to do. Okay, give them to me. Okay. The two options are. <laughs> what you saying? Paint and sip. Okay. Or plant plant a terranium, whatever terranium. Plant terranium. Oh. I want to do the plant terranium. You want to do the plant terranium? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be fine. Which one are you thinking? Well, I the reason why I went to the plant terranium because I was like, honey, uh, I gotta do like, okay, so y'all basically. Yeah, baby, we're gonna fix your food. It's ready. Uh, but basically, we did our family meeting. We have, like, at the start of the year, we started doing family meetings, and then we got off track with everything that's been going on with everything, y'all. And we can't wait to, like, share with y'all the, every, you know, the gist of, not the gist, but the full story. But until then, just know that it just took over our lives for a while. But anyways, we got back to our family meetings this week and we decided that we're gonna alternate weeks of planning dates. And so this week is my week. And so, honey, you've chosen the date. That was a pretty good date idea, both of them. Yeah, but I was like, I'm excited about the paint and sip, but I was like, this has to be for you, like something you enjoy, cause I'm like, I'm planning the date for you. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So I was like, yeah, let's let's do a two option. I feel like I feel like paint and sit would be something for me. Yeah, but yeah. So yeah, let me go ahead and book us. Look, I already got my date night idea for you tomorrow. I mean next week. <laughs> the one we've been discussing. Now you know I've been trying to get this paint and sit for a long time. No. Oh, you talking about paint and sit? Yeah. I thought you were talking about the movies. Oh my bad, that one don't count. Okay. Now the question is which day do you want to go? Um, where is it located? How you want me to do that? Come sit down, let me do that. I'm good. Come sit down, baby. Uh-uh. Because I spoiled my man. You sure do, 
Baby, why we why we cooking oxtail? Oxtail, bo, 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 bo. If you're cleaning, put our video, put either my video or Marcel's video on, and just let it play while you clean, or while you while you're cooking. <laughs> oh yeah, what day? Um, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I think Friday. You don't want to go tomorrow? Oh, um, we can go tomorrow. Hey, babe. Hey, baby. Blue light, look now, baby. Baby, hey, what you got? Aromatherapy. You like your mom? You like your mom? Not Olive Garden. Mm -hmm. I appreciate all you do. Thank you. Oh. That is so nice. Yeah. Hey y'all. <laughs> What's up y'all? I have not been on this vlog as of yet, but it's good to see y'all. So today is Wednesday and we are going to see Under the Sea Mermaid. Y'all know what time it is. So we're going to AMC. We try to go to Phipps, but Phipps just had us all the way out into next week. And Jamila was not a fan of waiting that long. So we actually got lucky. I don't want to say super lucky, but we got lucky with a Wednesday premiere day at AMC at Phipps. So that's where we're headed right now. And the reason why I say not as lucky because because it's all in the front row. So, and it's 3D. And I don't know if that's gonna work out, but we will find out. But the tickets were free because the last time we went to AMC, our chairs were not working. You know, the, the recline, the recline was not working. So they gave us two free tickets. We've been holding on to them for like six months now. So we went ahead and got them because those tickets, um, luckily for us, were very expensive. But as always, dressing casual, um, going to the theater because you want to be comfortable. I'm mad with this shirt though because that has been hanging up since last summer. So you got a hanger, Lord have mercy, a hanger point here and a hanger here. So it's like I got horns like on the side of my shoulder a little bit. I don't know what's going on with that. But I mean, I got the sweatpants on, we chilling, and I got, you know, some cool little Nike running shoes on. And of course, Blue is in the building. Mm hmm. Hey, what right up, Baba? Yeah? Uh huh. Yes. But alright y'all, I'm gonna pick y'all up once Jamila gets back down here and show y'all how we're kind of complimenting our outfits for the day. But um, leave that alone. Stop. But yeah, y'all. So good day so far. Tomorrow's the last day of school for me, so we're in a good mood. Actually, you know what? I'm not in a super, super good mood because I kind of talked about this on my personal channel, but my students this year, I just really, really, really like them. These, these set of students probably like one of my favorite student groups of like all time and again as a teacher when you see them walk out your classroom door for the final time it always hits you hits you right here in the fields so hopefully you know we still kind of somewhat keep in contact next year saying you know hey in the hallway and things like that but got delivery oh yeah this your food right here man excuse me and I still have not uh, hung that picture up because Jamil and I are actually thinking about changing all of this up, taking these floating shelves down, may do like some candle sconces right here to kind of elevate the luxurious look in the hallway right here. But I mean, that's a, you know, a summertime project. So maybe, honestly, maybe like Friday, we probably won't jump to it, but all right. Baby, you ready? Well, since I have time, because it's been maybe like 10 minutes since I put you all down and maybe 15 and Jamila still is not here, I'm gonna give you all some life updates. I just got finished sending an email back to a parent who sent me a thank you message for my presence in the classroom. Just to make a long story short, this particular family that I'm referring to moved from New York and she just wanted to say thank you for not only the good job that I did for this school year, but also just saying thank you for being present as a black male teacher in a major category of education like science. You see, when I first got my teaching degree, I used to work at a rec center and I was the gym coordinator. And every time I told people I was coming from school from Georgia State master's program to get my degree in education, they always thought, well, 
they were like, oh, what you about to do, become a PE teacher? And I was like, no, I'm about to become a biology teacher. And it will always blow them like away or they'd be taken aback just because they were not expecting that. And even once I got hired and I was still working at the rec center, they were saying the same things like, hey, what are you working? And, and, and again, it's nothing wrong with being a PE teacher. It's just that it's not common in certain parts of the world or uh, United States of America, because even from my personal experience, I did not have a black teacher until maybe late middle school. I'm talking like eighth grade. And even then, when I had a black male teacher, he was a PE teacher. And when I was in high school, I didn't have another black male teacher until like my sophomore or junior year. Maybe, I don't think it was senior, I think it was junior year when I had to take econ and world history in different semesters. And that was like, it's very hard to find a black male teacher. At our school, we actually have a lot of black male teachers and I love that because you need that diversity of educators within the field of, you know, where we teach at. But anyway, once I got finished responding to that email, I saw my glasses right here on my desk and I have not touched these glasses in honestly, maybe a month. And I um just wanna give an update on that as well. Sorry for this squeaky chair, but I know I still haven't disclosed what's fully going on with my eye and in due time I will, but I wanna share that story once everything is like, completely healed and resolved but i just thank god i thank uh, god for his presence i thank my wife for all the support emotional support that she has given me spiritual support as well as you all the subscribers who have prayed for me and my well-being um i am doing better so my right eye eventually started getting blurry before we found out what was going on and since i've started taking the medicine almost a month in now i don't depend on my glasses anymore i don't i don't need them anymore i just the reason i'm bringing them up is because i picked them up and i put them on and i just kept going you know on off on off to see what the difference was and my eye is com like right eye is not 100 percent. i'll say it's like a solid 85 90 percent the main eye that needs help is this one here it's still hazy and remember, that was what made me go to the optometrist at first, and then the ophthalmologist, and then the neurosurgeon, all that type of stuff. And it's getting better. But I've accepted that the left eye might be a journey, and I can't expect for things to happen overnight. Now, if God blesses me with that overnight healing. I'm going to receive that every single time. But I just wanted to share with you all that I am getting better. And, you know, I know that a lot of you have been praying for me. And if you could just continue that this healing journey will continue, you know, in this effectiveness, this efficiency and healing me all together. So um, medicine has been working out, in my opinion, I feel like it's been doing better. And I don't need my glasses because it, it came to a point in time where I actually depended on my glasses. I was having to drive with it. I was very limited in driving. Eventually, as you all saw in previous vlog, I was like, no, 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 you're not driving. And I stopped trying to drive so much at night. I needed it to like watch TV in the bed or even over there on the couch. And I can honestly say that my vision has improved, but still being a little bit more patient with that one right there. But that's it. That's all I want to update you all. I already told you that tomorrow's the last day of school. So I appreciate it. Man's best friend. I would pet you, but I just got the shower and we about to go on a date and I don't want to have to wash my hands. So maybe when I get back. What? Who is that? Is that your mama? Is that your mama? Hey, is that your mama? Hey, looking good. Hey. What's missing? I don't know. Oh, you got the hair things in. Yeah, baby, it's look good. Come on. You said I was a merman earlier. Yeah, my, my merman. Yo. So, Jamila. Oh, uh, necklace might be a little much. Because you already got the waist, the waist bees in. Yeah, waist bees on. I'm going to see which one need to go. But yeah, I just want to show you that we were matching. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Because my man wanted to match me. Little mermaid. Yeah. Here we come. Yeah. 
this is like tempting to say, oh, thumbnail moment. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, y'all. It literally has to be one or the other. Mm -hmm. Waste beads. Mm -hmm. Come on, what you thinking? Um, not to do waste beads. But they have pearls in them. What about the um? What about my little? I like that. Okay. I like it. You under the sea. That what you giving right now? I feel like there's something missing with my makeup. Go to bed, boy. I feel like there's something missing with the makeup. Um, I don't think so. What? They look good. Is it big on me? Mm-hmm. You ready? I don't know. Baby got to go, love. I know. Especially if you trying to go to TJ, and we ain't talking about TJ Mac. Baby trying to go to Trader Joe's because there's a TikTok maybe buy it thing look, at Trader Joe's. Yeah, I saw them. I saw those. Cause you didn't pick the purple ones. Did you show the fam? No. I just wanted to show y'all my earrings. I was choosing between these and I got a black pair as well. Honey, the black pair doesn't have a pearl. Oh. So that's why I chose these because they got a pearl. Got it. Should I do the ponytail? You should do let's get in the car. Oh. Yeah, it's time to go, honey. Oh. I don't want to have to be swerving in traffic today oh, to get us somewhere on time. Let's go. Let's go. Then let ride then. Blue, you not going, so calm down. And have the house cleaned up when we get back. I don't know why you got paper towel on the floor right here. You got a toy right here. I got the house looking crazy because it's been on the floor for like a month now. <sighs> Blue be good, okay. That's what he slobs. Oh, uh, stop slobbing. Because the slob doesn't, I don't know if you noticed, but it doesn't go away. It like literally just sits on top of the floor for hours. That's disgusting. So that's why I want to hit him. I think it's my hair. I think I might need to put another braid here, which I'm going to do in the car. Thank you. Be good, boy. Be good, big boy. Look at him. Where you going? Not this time, boo. There we go. We're here, y'all. Jamila's playing with some filters. Cause you a mermaid. Where your mermaid filter go? It lail. Oh, never mind, y'all. Sorry. Thought y'all gonna see a little sun, but it ain't happening. But a lot of traffic in the city today. Not sure what that's about. I know it's rush hour, but more than usual. And there were no accidents, thank God for that. But we're here now, 5.30, close to 5.30, and we need to hurry up and get our food ordered because sometimes it can take a tremendous amount of time to get your food when you order it. But we're here. They all had a pizza. They used to be the uh, sliders I used to get. They don't have no more. Okay. Real 3D, shout out. I mean, they need the mermaid stuff because they have this one thing. Yeah. They have this mermaid popcorn bowl and it's so cute. It's like yeah. only a Mexico bowl. Uh oh. Hey. What you got to drink, babe? A sweet tea from the bar. If you know, you know. So I bought Jamila this little mermaid. Oh, uh, yeah, and a queen? yeah, you a queen. You a mermaid queen. Mermaid queen. Mermaid queen. And it lights up. All right, how about see the food ready? Yeah, y'all. They forgot to almost give us our 3D glasses and our poster. So I saw a lady. I was like, "Excuse me, where you get that poster from?" And she like the front, and she started laughing because they've been forgetting stuff. But we gotta go sit down. Yeah. Jimmy Rockets again? Johnny Rockets, I'm here. <laughs> Jimmy Rockets, Jimmy, Jimmy the Cricket. 
You gotta meet the Good night. Under the sea. Take it from me. We still got these glasses. Yeah. Cause we still 3D. Wait, where my Oh baby, you about to pop off baby. Hey, you look just like Ariel. No, I don't. With that braid in there. Baby. Honey shell. You a mermaid, baby. Oh my lips already, they still look pretty good. Baby, that movie. Was so good. We we gonna we gonna talk about it, but we gotta hurry and get the Trader Joe's because they close in like twenty minutes, and we're like six minutes out. So it, they close in twenty five minutes. Yeah. And my man, my husband, Marcel said he's gonna take me. Babe, Babe I, I took my earrings it. off. Oh my god, I'm so thirsty. Honey, I asked you, did you want some more to drink? Babe, I was not about to drink. Rest of your drink. I had like two sips left. I tried to offer honey one of them. Gum say every time. <sighs> I'm going to see you. Hey, well. All right, y'all. We'll see y'all in a second. Oh. Oh. That's the family. That's the family. Mm -hmm. uh, movie? I was like, what was her audition like? Baby, they said... She said they told her to sing when she came in at an audition. Mm-hmm. And she can sing whatever she chooses to sing. Yeah. So she sang one of the songs. I don't know if she sang what song she sang, but she mm -hmm. said she closed her eyes. Mm-hmm. She said she opened her eyes when she was done and everybody was crying. No, that first scene when she was singing, I swear I felt like a tear was like, right. like starting to come out. That jump was so beautiful. Right. Like, now I ain't on no like soft stuff. Like that, that, that jump was, that jump was fire. Really good. Very nice. And it, baby, it's still bright out. Oh yeah, baby, 840. Mm -hmm. Waiting for the light change. 840, probably yeah, summertime, baby. Yeah. And then we're Yeah, bout when she walk, bout when she walk, hey. I'ma drop you off on the spot. Okay. Hey, hey. Now, mind you, we're here for body scrub. It bounce when she walk. Oh, I see everything. Hey, I see it too. <laughs> and that's what we're looking for. Look at her. Y'all follow on Instagram, TikTok, all that type of stuff. Hey. <laughs> Babe, it's been like 10 years. You still ain't got that dance down. That is not how you do the wheel. I didn't even know you smelling in advance. Mm. Wait, let me get some pictures. So, babe, so what are they right here? This is like a super popular scent from last year that like sold out and I couldn't get my hands on it. Mm -hmm. So I had to settle for one that I didn't want. Oh. But guess what they got in life? Look, they got a taste, uh, not taste, Lord, Chester. test sampler. Body scrub. Yeah, but they don't have. Can you hold it down while I try to open it? Yeah, I got you. Go ahead, do your thing. Ooh. Let me see. Oh, that, oh, that smell good. I'm going to give me one of these, too. <laughs> <laughs> Cause look, I know you ain't going to let me use yours. You know I'll be begging to use my scrub. Babe, I ain't about you no scrub, babe. Okay. How many you want? Get you, get you two. I want one of each. All right. My treat, date night. Getting a body wash. What's my That's why I have that. It don't smell that bad. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna do one of these. Alright, All right, so now we're on a manhunt for juices, but it's a soda, right? It's a juice drink. Okay, so that's what we're looking for. Can't find it, and they're about to close, and it's extremely cold in here, and we gotta go home and take care of Blue. Alright, what's your... What is rhubarb? Who knows? I love this pack. You want it? It's only eight dollars. When we go to the beach, give it beach vibes. Yeah. Found it. <laughs> Did all that just found it. You wanna get pineapple? Oh uh, nah. I think we got right there. I'll be mad when I get I run out of these. Yeah. Like when I'm when I drink all four. Yeah. Oh, our favorite honey zucchini and squash. Baby made some salmon with some zucchini and squash. Oh, we didn't put it on our drink Nah, that's on yours. I thought we were recording. <gasps> no, this ain't it. This is over there. Strawberry. Can you give me strawberry? Yeah, I got you. 
Got him. Hey, today's been a successful. You did your crab that. Yeah. You going to jail. You stole that. You know I love to read. <laughs> Somebody just called him and said, I love your matching colors. Jamil told me I saw, yeah, we just went to go see the mermaid. Oh, man, you man. I'm like, what, what's matching? Because I know my outfit ain't. Hold on, babe. We got somebody who ain't stopping. Sorry about that, y'all. We had a buggy interruption, car interruption. But yeah, the girl was like, oh my gosh, I love y'all's matching colors. Babe, I thought she was talking about, my, I thought she said my matching colors. Selfish. She said your matching colors. She didn't say y'all. She said y'all. She said yours. And so I'm like, thanks. But she was talking about our colors matching together. Mm -hmm. And um, what I say? He was like, yeah, we just went to go see the mermaid. I was like, baby. The mermaid. little mermaid. When we going to talk about this movie? Y'all, it was so good. If you um, are thinking about going, make sure you go. Everything is sold out, I'm sure. Matter of fact, speaking of which, let me go flex on Instagram while all my stores are. Right, all the stores we haven't posted. <laughs> so, for security purposes, Jamil and I made it a habit that while we're out, we don't post. Right, and just for like safety reasons. So just word of advice, that's just on my heart. So don't disclose your location. But anyway, so I got like a whole bunch of stories that I just recorded, saved, and it's time to post And then we'll tell y'all about the movie. I look ugly here. I look ugly in all mine. You ever just take a picture and you like, you just can't get the right angle? Jamila and I have concluded that we just- We ugly. We just ugly. <laughs> <laughs> I just knew I, was, I just knew I looked good. It's like the mirror. I knew I looked good. That one ain't bad. Yeah, you look good. Hey, but was it me or people weren't putting deodorant on that shop in there? Honey, them, uh, them Trader Joe's folk a little bit different. Them now. Trader Joe's or, or Trader. No, let me stop. They trade their deodorant for for freshness. They don't put on deodorant. Oh, you going there? <laughs> you going there right now? You don't, you don't, you don't agree? Mm-mm, you going there. <sighs> Oh, you hit that. You just hit that though. <laughs> Can you do it? No, it's. Uh, I, I was too high. I was too high. Honey, you missed the part. It's ah. Uh, it's ah. Uh, ah. Uh, no, listen. Ah. Uh, uh -huh. Listen. Ah. Uh, it's ah. Uh, ah. Uh, if I chop the screw that made into a beat, that job go hard. <laughs> Do it, honey. I believe. Mm, I ain't about to Try it, honey. I ain't about to go bad. Do it. I'm not about to go bad. Honey, come on. Up. 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 Kill that job. Baby, not they closed. We got here right on time. Yeah. All right, y'all. Let's talk about the movie. So y'all ain't just watching this as we try to find stuff to put. That junk is fired. Um, y'all. First of all, the movie. If I had to grade it out of 10, I'll give it a 100. Like, it was a thousand times better than, you than I expected it for it to be. Because growing up, I was more of a Lion King King uh, kid. I was a um, Aladdin, like all the boy Disney movies. So, but like that movie was so freaking fire. The mm -hmm. and Go ahead, go ahead. It was good. Yeah. No, go ahead. Like the animations, the CGI, everything was perfect and the singing was amazing um the acting was amazing even jamila when he saw ursula come out she was like i love me a good villain it's like the whole movie the whole movie was like perfectly written brought to like because a lot of times when you see disney movies you're concerned that the real life animation or the what's it called the the real acting or what what's they it call called? it the real the adaptation yeah you're concerned like how they jacked up the lion king but this was so don't go in on lion king lion king was good too perfect and uh of course i'm not going to talk about anything i mean the movie was the movie you know the storyline you've seen it but i say a hundred times out of ten like a hundred out of ten it was just a phenomenal movie uh Haley, holly how you say her name Haley. 
Hallie. Hallie, I'm sorry. She did an amazing job. Mm -hmm. And she honestly, not that my respect matters, but it's like I just see her in a different light now. Like, I, like her level of like the, the respect that I have for her mm -hmm. and her talent. Like I told you, man, when the movie ended, like the movie was just so inspirational because her talent was just on display nonstop the whole entire movie. And it just inspired me personally, like just to do more. Like really? create. Yes. Aww. But that was that. I, I got other pieces I want to say, but you kind of like touched on it when we left out. So I'm gonna let you have, have your moment. No, just talking about like, it gave the Black Panther vibe. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I was telling Marcel that, like, watching the movie, I just felt like how, how the, how the, how Black Panther affected the males, this little mermaid, I feel like, gave me those vibes for, for women, for young women, women in general. It yeah. was so nice. Yeah. It was, of course, representation matters. But just to, again, like when Jamila and I was leaving out the theater, we talked about how growing up, Jamila says she didn't have a representation type princess, princess. until Princess Tiana. In in the I was in college. Out. That was 09. That was my senior year in high school. Yeah. And just. That was your senior year? In high school, yeah. And that was my junior year in college. We two years. No, that means I was a freshman in college when it came out then. Mm -mm. It came out 09, but it's like what part of 09? Was it spring uh, 09 or fall 09? I think it was spring 09. Yeah. Yeah. I think I was just, yeah. I think no. I was in high school. We got to find a release date. But, it had to be fall 09 then. Yeah. But it was very cool to see. It was so nice, y'all. Like families of like black little girls being able to see that level of animation on the big screen and it's like if you get it you get it but like even like with black panther to me was so monumental because mm -hmm. growing up i'd never seen a black superhero right so for and like so for that the, just uh, the movie y'all the movie was amazing i i could literally go on and on and on and on but i'm not gonna do it because it's probably like a 30 minute segment but i can't do it it, it was, was so it was, good. It was super fire. Super fire. We can't give too many details, but I don't remember the original one. I know you made me sit down and watch it. Like you remember, we watched it during the pandemic. For the I watched it for the first time during the pandemic. Mm -hmm. I feel like it was last year though. I feel like if I go to my memories, it might be in my memories, honey. Like around this time. But yeah, it was. Did it veer away? Do you know? Do you um? Um, you know if it veered away from the original at all? Slightly, in some aspect. I'm not going to talk about it on here. Okay. Um, but very slightly to where it's like negligible. Oh. Um, for it to like, it was it was fire, y'all. Yeah. It was fire. And I like the representation, not only for black people, but you got Asian representation, white people, white or Caucasian representation, Asian representation. Indian representation like I don't want to give we don't want to give too much away, but it was it was amazing It was it was <sighs> What's that song called well, y'all we're gonna be doing that for like the whole every time Jamil and I get, watch like a good movie <laughs> We 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 literally either reenact like if they had like some type of like accent We're gonna do that and the soundtrack was so fire. The soundtrack was so fire. I know that's right. We didn't come this far to come this far. That means you need to subscribe to this video, like this video, comment, all that. Hey. That how the damn move right there. They out. They get out. We out. I need. Thank you, Trader Joe's. Yay! Thank you, Trader Joe's. You better hide your best of your.
Okay, popcorn. 